Hi there. So today we're gonna go on to investigate a claim that some people say that um, their computer is just not fast enough to type text. And um, that is because I heard people complaining about that um, about 20 years ago, but uh, I actually never had a chance to uh, verify it myself. What I have on my hand here is a Raspberry Pi. -Go. This microcontroller is supposed to emulate a keyboard that will input about 500 keystroke every second. The task of the computer is to process and display it. First, I'm always gonna use it to type LAN and then I will turn on the IME so that the IME has to process in software what I type and turn it into Vietnamese and display it on the computer. And um, what we're gonna do is we're gonna test on a couple of different systems. So the first one you see here, that's a ThinkPad X40. It was released about 20 years ago and it runs Windows 2000. That's a pretty old system right here. The next one I have here is a uh, um, ThinkPad X1 Nano. It was just released, I don't know, maybe um, a year ago um, with a 11th gen Intel processor. So that should uh, probably work well, but we don't know. The last one on the list is a MacBook Pro um, that was released in 2015. Um, Let's see how they fare with each other. So let's begin with the baseline, which means I'm not going to turn on uh, the IME for Vietnamese. So I'm going to um, just try to make it uh, count to 100 lines. Yep. So 100 line there, um, looks pretty good. So I'm gonna turn on the Vietnamese IME. You can see that uh, at first it's kind of, it was kind of slow, but it uh, kind of picks up. So that looks pretty good. Now let's go to um, the Linux computer that I have here. That's a, that's a X1 Nano. Uh, running the latest processor. So let's get the baseline going. I'm gonna press the button. You can see it works pretty well. Now I'm gonna turn on the Vietnamese IME. You can see here from time to time, the Vietnamese IME does actually not um, keep up with the, you know, the keystroke that I sent and it messes up the input. So that looks like a uh, IME um, bug that we have to fix somewhere. But um, what's really interesting is going to be this guy, which is a MacBook Pro running on a SSD. So let me uh, log into this MacBook Pro first. So let me, so it's, uh, you can see here, we are in, uh, plain text and without the IME enabled. So I'm gonna change it to US and let's see. You can see here, the system is already backed up. If I keep pressing, see the system keep backing up and all right, it's it's kind of work, but 
um, you can see that it's not very performance. Um, now let's turn on the Vietnamese uh, IME. You can see it's extremely painfully slow here. Um, I don't understand what the Mac OS uh, guys are doing to the IME, but this is definitely not what you know a good or performance um, system should do. Um, long after I released the button, um, you can still see that is still trying to type and process what what I type. Um, so that's not uh, very good. It takes forever for for one hundred lines to show up. So that's my findings. Uh, if you want to, uh, you know, get into the details of what I do, uh, I encourage you to read my blog. I will link it in the description. Um, so thanks for watching. Uh, goodbye.